The schools have a YouTube account that has previously been used for morning announcements and a few other media applications, but of course more principals are looking to use this now to create videos and post them for people. So these accounts can be accessed through your own account. We can actually sort of delegate them much like the email. So I'm going to show you how you would be able to find these accounts if they've been shared with you. You'll get an email inviting you to that account and then you're going to have to actually access it through your own so that you don't need any extra passwords. So I could do that by of course just clicking up here and typing in youtube.com or even from one of my other applications like Calendar. I can click the cluster of squares up in the corner and find on this collection here YouTube. So however I choose to get to it, I'm going to be logged in initially with my own account, which is why I see my face up here. So I have to click that once, and then I have to get into the YouTube Studio. This is where I would go if I was looking to upload videos of my own, or if I needed to make changes to my own videos, anything like that. But it's not my videos I'm interested in here. So I'm going to click on my profile a second time. Now that I'm into the studio, now I'm able to click switch account, and in my case I have the consultant ICT account here connected. So I can click on that account. This is actually where we do upload all of our videos. And from here I'd be able to go ahead and hit the upload video button, and I could select a file from my machine, or I could drag that file in there, and then go through the little wizard of steps. Uh, it's about four pages to set the title and make it public, choose a playlist, a thumbnail, that kind of stuff. Just sort of fill in a couple boxes, next, 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 and you will be presented with a link at the end to the video. Now if you're in your dashboard, you can click videos here as well once it's uploaded, and you will find all of your videos here. When I need to quickly share it with somebody, I will frequently just click the three little dots and click on the shareable link, and it will copy it for me immediately if I want to go paste that somewhere for somebody else. But that's how you are able to access any YouTube channel that you have had shared with you.